Hey, yo, what's good, everybody? I'm back. It's your boy Clutch, and today I got my boy with me, Issa. What's up? I'm and, Issa. Yeah, and we're gonna be reacting to My Hero Academia. Now, Issa has never seen My Hero Academia before, um, but you know, me and my friend Dre, that you've seen on my channel a couple times, we've been talking to him about it. We've saying he should watch it. This shit is lit. And um, yeah, how you feeling? You ready to? Well, me. I'm excited. I mean, I hear good things about it. Mm -hmm. I'm a Naruto stan, so yeah, you know, this so. is something new for me. But right, I'm I, ready for it. I really think he's gonna fuck with it, and um, he doesn't really know who. Uh, I think I know who his favorite character is gonna be already. Um, just say half hot, half cold. But yeah, um, without anything okay. else, let's just hop into it. All right, I'm ready. When the Funimation um, logo used to have a Dragon Ball. Yeah, I miss. I miss Air Gear. Oh yeah. Why are you being so mean? You're making him like cry, Kachan. <laughs> if you keep on hurting him, uh, I'll uh, I'll stop you myself. Not so much. <laughs> you want to pretend to be a hero? You don't stand a chance without a quirk, Deku. <laughs> The sad truth. All men are not created equal. <laughs> Why is that funny? <laughs> you guys are deep. I learned that some kids have more power than others. Oh man. But that won't hold me back. Yeah, if anything, it pushes me to do better. So you heard him say, um, quirk, right? Yeah. So that's basically what it means like power. Oh. Power, that's what they call it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Julia. That's one huge super villain. It's one of my favorite intros out of all of the, out of all of them. Well, I like the superhero aspect. Yeah, kind of like it's something new. You know what I mean? Like yeah. I don't see a lot of anime with that. That's kind of Marvel and Marvel the way that Yeah. I like the intro so far. It's not all super dramatic. The world became a superhuman society with about eighty percent of the population possessing some uncanny ability. Our streets looked like scenes from comic books. As cities swirled with chaos and confusion, a new profession dominated our collective consciousness. I'm guessing that guy was the baby, huh? It was an age of heroes. Uh, you know what? I don't want to spoil it. They probably 80% of the population has powers. So if you don't have powers, you're in a minority. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I'd probably be that 20%. <laughs> Sure when I'm gonna make it into the office. <laughs> it's like it would be a Another villain. That's the best excuse to get out of going to work. You got attacked by a villain today. <laughs> I probably still use that. Right. It's probably Woods. Cogly Woods. Why are you part of his quirk? You probably got a power. I would hate that one. Animation is no. Yeah, he got some hot drama skills. Right when he was using his special move. 
<laughs> Fuck that all up. Oh man, I'll be sorry. She had to mix me after it. Right. We had to mix. We get these first. for the world's next hottest hero. Hi there, everyone. I'm Mount Lady. And you don't have oh, to worry about have to this mix. bomb anymore. <laughs> She's getting all the credit. With the rise of superpowers came an explosive increase in criminal activity. While governments were stuck trying to figure out how to reform laws with quirks in mind, courageous people started performing heroic acts to keep our cities safe, protecting us against villains who abused their powers for evil. With overwhelming public support, heroes found an official place as peacekeepers overseen by the government. Those who performed the best were paid the most and got all the fame and glory. Their careers depended on their ability to stay in the spotlight. <laughs> Gigantification, huh? Well, she's definitely got the looks and attitude to be a crowd favorite. You heard what her name was? What was it? Kind of Mount Lady. Mount Lady, yeah. Lady. yeah. I thought that was kind of cool the first time I heard it because like, it's not like Gigantic or something. Like, you I heard taking notes before. over there? Want to be a hero yeah. too, huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> A lot of that, <laughs> what you just said, a lot of people. Yes, yes, you it's like everyone in the class has a problem. But no power usage allowed at school. Get a hold of yourself. Hey, teach. Don't let me in with this bunch of losers. I'm the real deal, but these guys will be lucky to end up as sidekicks to some busted D-lister. <laughs> Katsuki Bakugou. You think you're better than that, Katsuki? Let's go, I'll take you Katsuki. all on. Huh. You've got impressive test results. Maybe you will get into UA High. He's gonna try for the national school? That school has a 42% acceptance rate. It's impossible to get into. That's exactly why it's the only place worthy of me. I ace all the mock tests. You gotta I'm love the only the one confidence. at this school who stands a chance of getting in. I'll end up more popular than All Might himself. And be the richest hero of all time. People all across the world will know who I am. And it all starts with UA High. Oh yeah, Midoriya. Don't you want to go to UA too? <laughs> Just put him on the spot. He got his head down and everything. Like, why did you bring me up, bro? Teachers always do that. It's a, right. When you try hard not to be seen. Well, actually, they got rid of that rule. I could be the first one. <laughs> He said they got rid of the rule. Where if you didn't have a quirk, you couldn't do that. Rejects, you corkless well, wannabe! You really think they'd let someone like you in when they could have me? Huh? No way! You got it all wrong! <laughs> really! I'm not trying to compete against you! It's just, you gotta believe me! It's just that I've wanted to be a hero since I was little. Like a soul. I may not have a quirk, but I can still try my hardest, can I? Yeah, You'd like, never be able to hang with the best of the best. Batman. You die in the exam! But still had his parents. Defense Right. Zuku. The school's already crappy. You really want to embarrass it more by failing so hard? Damn. Someone stop that monster! You know you want sucker to catch his mind! Dude, where are all the heroes? Weird. Normally someone would swoop in right away. Maybe they're all still busy from that scene this morning. That's all my idea. Remember when we didn't have to worry about randos with quirks all the time? Seriously, there's no stopping him. Yes, there is. Good <laughs> call. You know it just, why? It's just once I saw that his hair and how scrawny he looked, it makes sense that it would be the most scrawniest person. Yeah. To huh? Don't tell me you're taking notes on how to be a hero. Mm -hmm. That's so pathetic. <laughs> He's delusional. Yeah, it's just like just they want to be heroes, but then they're still assholes. Yeah, like. That's so mean! <laughs> Most first string heroes show potential early on. People look at them and just know they're destined for greatness. When I'm the only student from this garbage junior high to get into UA, people will start talking about me like that. They'll realize I'm legit, the next big thing. That's not ego talking, I just know I'm good. Ego. <laughs> Here's a little word of advice, nerd. Don't even think of applying, or else. <laughs> Sounds like you're pretty scared. That's just sad. I thought you at least had some fight in you. He finally gets it. He'll never be a hero. Better to find out now instead of later, I guess. You don't pay attention to where you walking. You know, if you really want to be a hero that badly, there actually might be another way. Just pray that you'll be born with a quirk in your next life. And take a swan dive off the roof of the building. Mm. Yeah. I forgot he said that's hard. Yeah.
There's something wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Come on, Mom! It's computer time! Ready? Faster! Uh, let's go! Idolizing. Jeez, I think you've added 10,000 views to this one yourself, Izuku. I don't know why you like it. I think it's scary. <laughs> the video I loved was an old one. Disaster footage from a long time ago. But more importantly, it was the debut of the greatest hero the world has ever known. Who is he? The guy's already saved a hundred people at least and it hasn't even been ten minutes. This is, this is crazy. I can't believe it. I am here. So it's stereotypical here. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, he really like like Stan is here. Yeah, like that's his life. That's his God. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Once he get his quirk, he's gonna Sorry, be just like him. Damn. So oh, nonchalant. Oh, he was dear. just like, bro, it's not so happening. Really <laughs> <there's something wrong? laughs> Look at his face. Most of the other kindergartners in his class have begun to show signs already. My records say you're a fourth generation quirk user. What powers do you and the boy's father have? Nothing too special. I can float small objects towards me and my husband breathes fire. They're useful enough, I suppose. Izuku should have already manifested one of these quirks or a combination of both, but after viewing his x-rays, I don't think he's going to. You see, when superpowers first began appearing, there were many research studies conducted, and doctors discovered a link between the bones in a person's foot and their likelihood of developing a quirk. People with powers have only one joint in their pinky toes. Their bodies have evolved into a more streamlined version of the human form. You can see here that Izuku has two joints in his pinky, like roughly 20% of the population these days. That's hard. Based on the research that's available at 6 Imagine not having powers, but your, both of your parents had powers. That would make it suck even worse. That mom, there's always a smile on his face, no matter how oh, bad man, they get. Oh man, they're trying to tell you the heart scream. Nobody's crying, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> What can you say to that? Oh man. See, that's I'm why you sorry, don't have kids. Zuko. I wish things were different. That's not what you're supposed to say. Mom, that's not what I needed you to say. Couldn't you see? My world was crumbling. There was only one thing I wanted to hear. I made a decision that day. No matter what anyone else thinks, I have to believe in myself. And I'll keep smiling, just like him! Take over his body, I think. I think I'm dying. Damn, now he's just walking around the floor, man. Yeah, that shit happened, like. Somebody. 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 Somebody.
got the groceries. He has to have some downfall. I already know. All my... I feel like he has a weakness that he's going to get exposed eventually. What makes you say that? Is that no one is perfect. It's just they they're putting him off as too perfect. Man. He's still a dope character. Right? You already said it. Texas, Texas Smash. For some reason, all his attacks are like named after... Well, there is a reason, you'll find out, but they're like named after like cities in America. Oh. Oh, imagine yeah, getting saved like by your, like the nigga you, the person you idolized yeah, the whole life. I couldn't imagine, but you, <laughs> I'm sorry, one boy looked all uh, surprised, like, um, are you doing something wrong? Why are you? Sorry about that back there. I didn't mean to get you caught up in my justice thing. Usually I pay more attention to keeping bystanders safe, but it turns out this city sewer system is pretty difficult to navigate! <laughs> it's not how you got a comic book effect. Big help, yeah. Did you? I've captured the evildoer! Red, white, and blue. The real thing in the flesh standing right in front of me! Be like, wow, oh, man. I don't want to imagine. Like, you could die, bro. <laughs> He's I'm rolling. Like, oh, that's a good point. Yeah, I'm like. I'm <laughs> so far it wasn't a slow start yeah it got right into it yeah and it wasn't like too much all at once right got to understand the problems and all that but i look forward to the next exactly the, the, the best they say the best hero flushed out in the first episode a little bit um zuko i don't know why i keep it's so weird for me call him that because uh, i want to call him deku because why do people call him You'll find out, but Deku, you got a little, you got his backstory. 
Um, so yeah, I think it was a good first episode. Yeah. So what did you, um, where do you think it, the story's gonna go from here? I feel as if, cause I'm waiting for the, uh, the dude that looked like Prince Zuko. But <laughs> I personally feel as if it's gonna, um, it's gonna get to a point where he makes some suit or something like that, I guess. Okay. that's what so everyone you, who doesn't have powers do. So you, like, you, you reference like Batman. Like he's gonna be, you think he's gonna be like a Batman type? Yeah, I mean, okay. there's no, you're going to a school of superheroes. You have to be able to. He's at least gonna have a suit. Yeah, something to compete with people. Something. With powers, yeah. And I feel as if I don't know if it's gonna happen, but the one dude, the asshole, I feel like he's gonna turn into a villain because he feel like it's how could uh, he Bakugo. get? Yeah, I feel like it's like how could he get chosen over me? So he's probably like, right. he's probably gonna be like f heroes. And so, so you think, so you think that he, they're gonna take the test to get into, because they say UA, yeah. and UA is basically like the, the yeah, number one hero um, school. Said 0.2 percent. So yeah. So you think literally only one person is gonna get in from that right class. So you, you think Midoriya is gonna get in and Baku is not? Yeah, and I feel okay. like that's gonna put him on some like Sasuke dark path type shit. Okay. And I feel that's like a good prediction. I feel like he's gonna get exposed. All Might? Yeah, he's gonna get exposed. I already know that. What makes you say that? Why you... Because they already hinted at, like, oh, look what happens when he spends too much time in that body. Okay. And then he's off weak and frail. I feel like someone's gonna notice that he's gonna get exposed. And it's just gonna be like this whole big thing. I mean, but you saw that villain. He literally blew him away with one punch. So... Yeah, you... that, but that's an amateur villain. Now, I'm sure they're not gonna show me the best villains on the first episode. True. All right, well, I guess that wraps it up. Um, yep. I hope you guys enjoyed that reaction. If you did, please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe if you're new. And, yeah, we're going to have Issa back here um, pretty soon to record, you know, episode two. Um, yeah, just let us think, let us know what you thought about this first episode. And, yeah, as always, peace.